Hey everybody, Xavier Thorne here, and welcome back to Chaos on Deponia. Flip this over, there we go, so I'm going to pop the rest of my arm off. And I noticed something. Uh, not only do we have a platypus, the frog, and these transporters, there's a fly in this one. Which got me thinking. If Lord of the Flies taught us anything, is that this is going to make one... Uh, of an abomination. Hello. <laughs> the stupid creature has occupied the matter transporter. But since I've studied the technical literature, I'm not afraid of genetic fusion. A toast to Captain Cockroach. Um, I, I don't think fly, frog, and platypus is going to make cockroach there, Rufus. Like I said, one <laughs> of an abomination. <laughs> the stupid butt sent a toast. Okay, I'll say that with all of them. And I talk to the fly? Get out! Now! Uh, why didn't I pack my animal trainer hat? <laughs> uh, it's good to have an animal trainer hat. So, what if I just... Oh, God. Oh, there's the revolution. Oh, jeez. Um, so I need to get to that one, or... Wait, no. Okay, each of these will take me to a different place then. Um, uh, what is this? Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. Can I actually not go around? Hi, guys. I think I can actually go to this one and what happens here? Oh, jeez. Oh, genetic fusion is irreversible. You gotta be oh, okay, kidding me. Ah, okay. <laughs> uh, I see what I can do too. There we go. Now we can go back to here and toss the sea off. Cause now the platypus is over here. Hey, Anna. Well, how are things at the front? Wolfush, at last. Grab a weapon and help us. We are hopelessly outnumbered. Uh, no, if I get involved, I'll just expose your incompetence. But... You can do it, and I'm not saying that because there is any hope, but to motivate you. That's what you call leadership. How you doing up there, Tony? Okay, so... The Organon. The Organons outnumber us. Well, <laughs> as long shit. as these idiots play cannon fodder, maybe I have a chance to sneak past. Um, Rufus, you know that we can hear every word, don't you? Don't talk, soldier. Fight! Uh, okay, so this will just be climb up, or maybe not. Go, go, Rufus, rubber arm! <laughs> yeah, okay, so uh, you have to be the fly to get before. to that one. From the frog... Maybe it'll be safe to go there, or wait a minute. Where's that thing? Oh, wait, no, we have to go up the ladder, so we have to get to this one as regular Rufus. Oh, oh. Aww. He just looks so sad and helpless. Now he's just like, oh, help, come on, guys. Let me out. Okay, going, oh, wait, I can go up? Up we go. Hey, Tony. How <laughs> the rebels? Without the loving care of their wise leader, those fools don't stand a chance. It's their own fault. Uh-huh. Here we go. If we hit this, we're going to be... Right, yeah, because... Thing. Reasons. So... I need to get... To this one. Oh, I may have screwed up by that. Can I do it this one first? Hmm. I would like to see the frog and platypus fusion this. I have to come out in this one. Oh wait, right, so let's just do this. <laughs> Cycle through. Wanted to see this anyway. So... 
and as Frog, I am stuck in whatever container I go in. Okay. We know that now. Oh. Transport out this one. Alright. Let's go hit this one. Gotta put the platypus back in it. Putting me here. Allowing me to fly back over here. It's like, wait, can I use it? Ow! Oh, here's a hatch. I, I mean... <laughs> nice save, Rufus. Okay, so we transport back, putting the fly back into reasonable transport. That means we still have to deal with the platypus, though. Well, we wanted, well, I wanted to see this anyway. Go Pleta Rufus! Oh god. So, Platypus and Frog, you cannot move. I'll get it. Just need to think. So I know I need to cycle through. Wait a minute, go back as the fly. That might give me this actually. Then go use this one. <laughs> Okay, no. We can't use an occupied when we're already transformed. Yeah, yeah. Eat me. Eat me. Alright, it's not gonna. So. Let's so we need to come out with this one untransformed. Of course, being able to move around as the fly, I would say, is key to that. What is the solution? Okay, wait, give me a minute. Okay, so we need the platypus to be on this end. That we know. Now, unfortunately, we need this transporter. Which means we need to find a way to get the fly out. Wait. Get through this. I'm not supposed to just eat the damn fly as the frog. Seems like it would be too easy. Because having one truly empty transporter I think would help. The fly needs to die, let's be honest here. Up, oh, yep, there you go. Bitch. As Aaron Paul would say. Yeah, bitch! I win. I know I don't do it right. I'm no Aaron Paul. But here we are, we succeeded. There we are. At last, I was on the verge of leaving without you. You know what they say about the Organon. That they resulted from an early attempt to cross human DNA with hey, soil flower? Eagle. That we always stick to our schedules. Or, ah, 
You have your mother's sense of oh, humor. Yeah, that's we would have been here sooner if half the tower weren't cordoned off due to fighting. Do you often have armed riffraff hanging out in your facilities? Yes. This ridiculous peasant uprising should be of no concern to you. Oh, Still, it seems odd that the Deponians are revolting at this very moment. Do you know anything about it? It's Rufus. He's trying to stop me. Rufus, uh, persistent little fellow. Wait, so... He's an idiot. You underestimate that him. Is That's it, baby. Talking. You tell him. He's only half as stupid as he looks. Double that, and you might have a point. He just doesn't know when the time has come for him to quit. Speaking of time, are you ready now? Oh, just wait. a moment. I left my bag inside. Get on with it. We will cast off as soon as the engines are warm, with your bag or without. Oh, it's no way right. Rufus, or not Rufus, but Cletus took the remote and the cartridges, so he probably put Lady Gold's personality back in Gold's body. While the other cartridges have Spunky and Baby Goal. Because Lady Goal is the one that wants to just. She's still tell totally this place. in secret. Right, 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 right. Right. Oh, a bomb control room. Wait, isn't that right when it came out? Oh, wait, no, the, the hatch. I, I don't know where the hatch is. The hatch is gone. No, well, we don't need to go back anyway. Into the bomb control room. Cletus! Up oh, there. Uh huh. Cletus? Body. What's he doing? Bomb controls. La la la. Could he be <laughs> fiddling with the bomb, bomb, bomb controls? controls? I'm <laughs> fiddling with the bomb controls. A la la la. That's supposed to be chicken no, What the hell, man? Looks like. Your this is right. just what it looks like. I'm really messing with the boo, with the bee, with the bar, with the bow, with the bomb controls. That. That, oh, that a boo, that a bee, that a bar, that a bow. Rufus got the groove, yeah. <laughs> but wait, that traitor, he's actually fiddling with the bomb controls. I've got to stop him. Well, there's Donna. Oh, in the bag. Oh, we just got to be able to get to it without Cletus seeing us, I, I would wager. There's the door. Oh, wait. Oh, never mind, he doesn't care. Into the bag. Hey, there's Donna's remote yep. and the two other cartridges. I'll insert one of them. Hmm, unfortunately, Gold's remote is missing. She must still have it on her. Okay, so we have Donna. I'm going to say our solution is not to put Donna back in her body. The official street. I'm going to assume the door's locked. Well, why assume when we can know? Very quiet. Oh, wait. Yep, locked. Darn! All right. It's locked. Now, how am I supposed to bravely clobber him from behind? Easy. I already established this. We're going this way. Apparently, you can only switch the contents of Donna's implant with this remote. Yeah. Okay. And I invented the remotes for situations like this, with a little help from Doc. Sure. Okay, so I guess we do have to put Donna back in her own body. All righty then. What? Hmm. No picture, no sound. Oh, really? Donna! Donna! Goal? Donna, anybody? Huh, apparently nobody's home. No wonder, the implant is empty. Anything else in here? Hmm, unfortunately, she must still have it. Okay, so how do I get to that? Okay, this way then. Oh, wait. Rufus, what are you doing here? You missed me. I know. But now's not the time for our big reunification foo-for-all. Our what? Cletus is next door where the bomb controls are. 
And... And obviously not here to beat some sense into you. Good heavens, where is Spunky Girl when you need her? Deactivated by your wonderful fiancé, who, as we speak, is about to... To take me to Elysium. No. I know. And I know you don't like it. But stalking me isn't going to change a thing. Your path just leads you from one disaster to the next. Perhaps that is the right path for Spunky Girl, but it is not mine. Now listen to me, will you? Why should I? You're not listening to me either. I'm going with Cletus. You should be glad I'm not setting the organ on on you. You have exactly three seconds to get out of here. That is my parting gift to you. But go! One. I... Two. Cletus is only taking advantage of you, and when you look down on my burning cadaver, you're really going to regret some of the things you just said. There. So there. <laughs> and now? Now we are entirely fucked. Can please just this? Oh wait. Oh, I right. That was a cartridge, not a remote. Oh, hey. Shh. Not so loud. Hey. We've got a problem, or, or rather two, and a half. We'll make that three. It's been a while since I counted. What's the matter? You see Cletus back there. He's rather blurry. Something isn't right with my eyes. Oops. Oh. Look, Rufus. I'm Donna. Yeah, I know. Feed him to the sharks. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Now, That's can we briefly goal, consider definitely. the problem at hand? Sure. Bring it on. Cletus is about to return to Elysium with Lady Goal. And just now, I caught him messing with the bomb controls. I think he wants to eliminate the population of Deponia. Then yeah. there would be no more reason not to blow the place up. Oh, big time meanie. This is hard to believe. Yeah, Lady Gold doesn't believe me either. Could you help me make her change her mind? Maybe she'll listen to herself. Actions are better than thoughts. I learned that from you. Problem is, well, she Baby obviously Gold. had a brilliant teacher. If her people skills are only half as good as mine, then... Yeah, this is uh, good go. Maybe I should follow her, just to make sure. But we need Spunky Gold. And therefore, Cletus is the good guy, and Rufus is nothing but a... Uh... Hey, ladies! How's it going? Lady Gold, just explain to me why you cannot be trusted. What? But you were supposed to persuade Lady Gold, not the other way around. Oh, right. That was your plan? I was almost going to say you need to think of something better, but you might take that as encouragement. Well, I do. Please don't fight. Don't worry, baby. Lady Goal is about to see her mistake. Yes, I do see my mistake. The mistake is you. And even Baby Goal isn't quite as naive as you seem to believe. Right. But, hey, look. Did I just see a funny butterfly in there? A butterfly? Whee! I hate you. We're saying? Go on, <laughs> believe that. Uh, okay, now then. Let's actually use my brain. Put Spunky Goal in. Oh, I'm really getting tired of this stupid I know. It's Are a you pain okay? In the ass. More or less. Can I have a summary? Okay. We're in Argus's bomb control tower. I think that Cletus intends to trigger the detonation. Why, that's slimy! And where is Donna Goal? Actually, you are now Donna Goal. Ew! Yeah, yeah, Lady Goal has got your body, and she's on the balcony outside. She still thinks that everything's fine with Cletus. Perhaps you can talk to her. Maybe she'll listen to herself. I most certainly will. Luckily, I know how to talk to recalcitrant women. I learned that from you. Well, she obviously had a brilliant teacher. If her people skills are only half as good as no, mine, are better. then... Hmm, I, I foresee an ass-whooping sure. for Lady Gull, but that's just me. Don't you even notice how little sense you're making? But I damn well saw it! Refrain from cursing, please. I hate it when you do that. You're hardly no going shit. to change my mind by using expletives on me. So what about using my fists on you? How typical. Whenever you run out of arguments, you will to violence, also known as dyslexia of the soul. Let me show you how I spell knuckle sandwich. Mm, perhaps with an S, as in stepladder. Ladies, ladies, there are peaceful ways of settling your differences, like uh, a round of mud wrestling. Rufus, oh, you're not Rufus. helping. I might have known you were behind this. You really stop at nothing, don't you? Well. 
I'm doing it my way. Your path just leads you from one disaster to the next. Perhaps that is the right path for Spunky Gold, but it is not mine. It's okay, Rufus. No need for you to help me out. This is just between me and me. You go take care of Cletus. He's a bigger problem now. Oh, right. Almost forgot about him. So, where was I? In a manure pit, judging by the smell. What? I'll get you for that! Whoa. I suppose they really should discuss that among Man, themselves. He's gone. How can you carry on such extended conversations with yourself? I find that a surprising. bit disturbing. <laughs> disturbing. But back to more pressing issues. I must stop Cletus before he... Huh? Too late. Cletus? He already did it. But, huh? Where did he go? Yeah. He already did it. So, um... Now it's my turn. Yep. It's fiddle. Well then. Let's undo the mess that Creep has caused here. That shouldn't be too complicated. After all, he managed to do it. <laughs> you have no idea. What? What, well, what is this now? A countdown? No, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop! That was a close one. But if that was the countdown, then what was Cletus doing here? Something fishy's going on here. Indeed. Hey! You Cletus, what are you bitch. doing? Open up, you coward! Why should I? So that you can go ahead and mess up my plans again, loser! Well, it looks like I already did. At least you didn't manage to trigger the bomb. So, who's the loser now, huh? You, of course, as always. You see, I never meant to trigger the bomb. But I saw you fiddling with... I was trying to sabotage the explosion for crying out loud. Ulysses' plan was sheer lunacy. I blocked the suspension clamps. The Organon are not going to detonate the bomb with it like that. There would be little damage to the planet. It would only destroy the bomb tower. And by the time they find the fault, the Council of Elders will be aware of the existence of the Deponians. Wait, wait, you should thank me. I saved your people. And you too, alas, for now. Don't make me laugh. The Deponians mean nothing to you, or to you, but at least I'm not afraid of admitting that. All I care about is gold. For some reason, she is hell-bent on giving Deponia a fair chance of survival. And you know me, I would gladly sacrifice the world just to make a lady smile. The elders will probably blow the place up anyway. I actually even hope so. But by then, it will no longer be my responsibility. And let's be honest, you wouldn't have done more than that for your people, would you? So why would you make me a worse match for gold? And given that, what could possibly prevent me from taking her to Elysium? Well, mm, she's probably got her go ass ahead and by stop now. me. All right. Hey, you moron! What are you doing? I'm switching the countdown back on. It's a little shorter this time. Are you out of your mind? Shut Entirely. that off this instant! Happy to oblige. Is this the switch? Oopsie! I can be such a klutz sometimes. I wish there was somebody in here who knows his way around this stuff. Too bad you already have to leave. You rotten chunk of sewer slime! What have you done this time? Let me see. Perhaps I can bypass the controls. You had better pray that this works. That traitor! That traitor! Okay. Ah, then. See you, bitch. What are you doing? Ow! Damn. <laughs> oh! oh yeah, I told ya! Ass whooping! Oh! Ow! Ow! Right. Take 
Not in the face! Yes, in the face! There's probably something wrong with you. Maybe not. He's even uglier up close! Doesn't stand a chance against the lady goal. Uh -huh. so... Monkey goal. What, lady? All right, I need to be in control. Ah, fuck. Lady Gold still has the remote! So what? Don't use it! Grab the remote! No! Hey! Got it! Now what? Push the button! Press it! Press the remote! No, you! Baby Gold! I... Oh, wait, nope, Flutter bags? Go for the eyes! Oh, wait, what's this then? Wait a minute. Got it. Mistake. What? <laughs> nice try, Dirt Ball. One could almost admire your persistence. I suppose I should kill you now, but I'm beginning to feel sorry for you. Who knows how I would behave if I'd been born in a landfill without any hope for a better life, without any hope. I would love to do you a favor and put an end to your useless existence. You would never give up on your own. Just a little well-aimed kick. Too bad mouse? that isn't possible, because you've got something that belongs to me. You need the remote. That's Donna in Gold's body! She must be totally confused. Well, even totallyer. Right idea. Right. For the last time! Will you give me that accursed remote? No. Uh, I know! You need the ascension codes, don't you? What are you getting at, smart ass? You know exactly what I want. This isn't about goal, is it? Quit wasting my time, you freak! Hand me that remote this instant, or we're all going to be blown to kingdom come! The bomb is ticking! Oopsie daisy! No! <laughs> you crack brained numb nut! <laughs> uh. Goal! Oh, that was just. Wow! Well done! Yes, looks like it. I just didn't want to believe it. But you were obviously right about him all along. Why did he do that? Eh, doesn't matter now. Help me up! Yes, yes, of course. But first, I need to apologize. I have wronged you. Apologize I just later. thought that... I thought you were lying to me. I should have trusted you from the very beginning, apologize not later. him. Triggering the bomb sequence behind my back. Unbelievable. I could never be with such a liar. And still, that's what's happened. No, Cletus is the liar, right? He is, but... He is, but I triggered the bomb to trick him. Um, well... What is that supposed to mean? Is there something else you want to tell me? No, Cletus is lying. There is one thing. What? Well, I must know everything. I know the timing could be better, but I can only trust you again if you tell me everything, and I want to trust you. Well... There is... Out with it. How can I put this? 
Just say it. We don't have much time left. Just do it, Rufus. Um, what? Is there something else? Yes. What? Lied to me? Rufus? Yes, Cletus lied. Fuck it. Cletus didn't lie to you. What are you saying? He didn't start that sequence. I did. You? Does that mean Cletus hasn't betrayed me no, after it does all? Not mean I that. knocked him down for no good reason. In a way, yes. But I'm telling you the truth. So that shows I'm the good guy here, right? No. It only shows that the best possible Rufus is still worse than Cletus. Goal! Goal! Don't leave me hanging! I told you everything, didn't I? Goal! Crap. Well, Rufus, once again you managed to turn the tide against yourself at the last moment. <laughs> As I said before, you don't even want to win. At least not by cheating, right? You played pretty well so far, but eventually the cards must always be laid on the table. I've got two queens, and you? Are we playing rummy now? <laughs> Looks like you screwed up once again, Rufus. Or do you have a trump left up your sleeve that I'm not aware of? Actually, I do. Oh, one more remote. This isn't a game. This isn't the end, you know. Oh, I see. You're hoping for a third act. Which we the know hero there is. dashes onto the runway, knocks on the window of the high boat. There's only one catch, Rufus. You are not a hero. You are a tragic comic clown. And this is not a romantic comedy. This is some sort of self-reflective, independent crap in which there are no answers at the end. No happy ending. Only a good look at an ugly reflection, which then blabs the subtext as well. Chaos cannot win when the goal is order! <laughs> Something like that. It's not a game. You think this is a game? This is about an entire planet full of innocent people. Oh, that's enough of your pseudo-moral nonsense. For you, this was never about the people. This was about you getting the girl. So, my friend, what is the difference between you and me? Maybe the fact that I'm not an arrogant snot? Precisely. You are the filthy underdog, the outsider from the underclasses. But only as long as you always lose. You can't win without becoming exactly like me. No more than you can live on Elysium without destroying Deponia. There is no scenario in which you... Janosch and his resistance fighters will be up here any moment! We know we Those to... miserable creatures don't make me laugh. I seriously doubt that any of them are still alive. Whoever concocted this attack must be completely retarded. The whole action is so stupid. I can hardly imagine you didn't have something to do with it. Hey, uh, okay, change the subject. Goal won't let that happen. Tell him, Goal. I'm sorry, Rufus. Me too. It must have been very difficult for you to show me your true face. He did that? I see now who you are. Very brave. But it isn't enough. Unfortunately. You've disappointed me once too often. You heard the girls. Game over. <laughs> I've still got the other remote. You're still missing a queen for your full goal! Oh, never mind that one. You can keep her. The game is over. And the jackpot is enough for me. Two amazing, gorgeous women. One on the left, one on the right, and me in the middle. <laughs> her purest and noblest qualities finally reunited. More than enough goal for a modest man like me. All you have is a stupid cartridge with nothing but goals, mental and childhood troubles. That one is rude, defiant, argumentative, forever spreading chaos. Just like Rufus. Exactly. Completely useless. Uh, you do realize you're talking about me, right? What? <laughs> At least I'm honest. You like that about me, don't you? Yes. 
Yes, you're right, of course. But it's a piece of yourself, Gaul. Without it, you'll never be complete. So what? We don't give a hoot. I have the better goals and the ascension codes. We should finally crank up the countdown now. It's not like I can switch it off at this point. Thank you, Rufus. But at least the explosion will be limited to the tower itself. Say, thank you, Cletus. Because I'm a gentleman, I shall give you and your rebel buddies enough time to make a hasty retreat. That's what you do best, after all. Farewell, Rufus. You weren't really a worthy opponent, but that probably would have been asking too much. No! You can't do that! Cletus! Gold belongs together! Wait! I... Uh, uh. This is getting a bit exhausting! It's... Uh, great! Ah! They've stopped shooting! Oh, at last! Do you think we won? Actually, I'm not sure. Ah! Ouch. Rufus! Listen up, everybody! It's Rufus! Yeehaw. Uh. All right, look, guys, we don't have time. We have to get Janosch? out of here. You guys are alive? Of course we are alive. What did you think? We need to get out of here as fast as possible. The tower is about to explode. Then let us gather everyone together as fast as we can. Don't forget me. Go! Wait, what? Not her again. Go! You? But wh why aren't you with Cletus? Well, the prospect of going home was really tempting, but I would have missed an important part of myself. A and Cletus? I locked him out on the gangway. Spunky Girl would surely have found a more <sighs> dramatic solution. But She'd I found myself him. cool enough, and Cletus blew a fuse. However, in the light of the impending explosion, he must have decided that one goal was enough for him. Yeah, Speaking crap. of which, we mustn't waste any time. But what about you? I mean, what about your third part? Aren't you going to miss Baby Goal as well? Hmm, you know, I happened to find this on my way down here. Do it! Put Donna back. No goals for you! Yes! She is definitely going to change her mind. Just trust me. Ambassador, it is time. The tower has been evacuated. We must leave at once. All right. All right. <laughs> Not gonna lie, right now this where this ending is feeling good. Right now we have By the, the way, upper hand. Girl, I knew you'd come back. Oh, no, you didn't. Yes, I did. I can leave again, you know. <laughs> but you won't. Our good plan went awry, and I know the story. You have to admit you enjoyed it a bit. Now you saw a reason, dump your egotism, and wait against the public benefit. Because close to the bonus, where you need cojones And platypuses and memberships to opposing underground organizations So do unpack the bag, now it's anyway way too late to sack me And secondly, where am I gonna stay? There you go. I was waiting for something like that. Because we know there's another one.
Huh. That actually kind of seemed a little rude with the voice actors. I mean, they put... After the voice actors, who was Rufus, who was Goal, then just the rest of the names, did, they, they don't get the credit of who they were. That, Granted, there's precisely fuck all I can do about it, but... and I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you all in the next game where hopefully things can go monumentally right for us probably the wrong word I don't care and hope and hopefully in things going right for us we put a stop to Cletus's plans and save Deponia But that does beg the name of the game. Goodbye, Deponia. Hmm. I can speculate of what this could be hinting at, but I'm not going to mention it. Because if it turns out I'm right, then I'm inadvertently spoiling it. And I'd rather not do that. So, goodbye, everybody. There's a button here somewhere.